Hi Libra, how's it going? Well, this is going to be your love general reading for uh, November 2017. And um, you know how I did the first set for singles and couples separately? Well, I think it was not half-assed, but it was so short. Because uh, you know how I'm trying to get two short parts in like one video? I feel like it was not like informative enough or it just wasn't enough I don't know so I decided that I am I am gonna be doing general love readings you know and you can apply it to your situation and I'm still trying to keep my videos short and informative at some point but you know we'll see how that goes maybe general love readings would be better than uh, you know couples and singles and stuff like that anyways let me look into your recent past Oh God, King of Swords in reverse, dealing with somebody kind of ruthless, or you could be that, you know, because you are an air sign, acting kind of angry and aggressive and ruthless towards somebody, or that could have been your partner or your love interest or somebody that was just annoying you. The hanged man. You either like you felt like you needed to wait, but see what happens in the future with this person or you are waiting something out basically not being able to kind of move oh nice i got three cards and give me a second okay guys i don't know if you can see but this is how they fell the one in the middle is the sun which is really good now okay yes four of pentacles in reverse and uh um eight of cups so okay guys so you chose to move away from this person whoever that was you chose to let them go not cling to them anymore or whatever you were doing and you chose to move towards happiness you see so great okay i think i'm done with your past here i think i know what exactly is going on moving away from somebody ruthless somebody that's not good for you all right november libra november mm. ace of swords in reverse still however even though you decided to move from this person um you couldn't get clarity on you you can't get clarity on a certain situation with this person like you want some kind of truth from them maybe but they keep lying to you or they're not telling you everything that you need to know <clears throat> ace of cups in reverse well, you're definitely not happy about the situation. You know, you want to fix this somehow. I don't know. Or since you moved away, you just don't want to be bothered. But guys, this is not really what I wanted to see. <laughs> and uh, the lovers in reverse. Uh, so yeah, definitely you're not happy about this person. Something they're doing is not making you happy i mean come on to get an ace of swords in reverse ace of cups in reverse and the lovers in reverse all at the s in the same spread this is a little bit too much that person really did piss you off and you're trying you know you are moving towards happiness towards joy and better times it's just not that easy yet you know it's always challenging seven of pentacles okay so it's kind of like is it even worth it you know to wait for this to somehow subside or change or whatever because you're not getting your clarity yet ten of wands yeah because it's so much like heaviness on you on your shoulders you know you're almost there you're almost at the castle you're gonna drop those soon you know you're gonna get rid of your worries and your problems and just all the burdens that you have on your shoulders you're gonna get rid of those soon, okay, soon. Just hang on a little bit longer. It's definitely heavy on you. The fool in reverse. Yeah, feeling stuck, not being able to take a risk or just knowing how foolish and crazy this person might be, you know, the one that you're dealing with. Um, it is definitely burdening you. And what's burdening you even more is that you can't quite get a new beginning. You're trying to move on, but something is stopping you. Three of Pentacles, okay, that's good. So 
maybe you decided to distract yourself or decide to distract yourself in November, you know, doing something else, working towards something else, which is good, guys, because this is not, the beginning of the spread is not really good. Queen of Cups in reverse, you could be dealing with a water sign or somebody overly emotional. It could be your energy, you know, feeling overly emotional about this whole situation. You know, it's like you've had enough, kind of. It's also, you know, blocking your emotions, um, which is sometimes good, I think. You know, you'd rather not feel all of that than experience all the pain, I would say. <clears throat> Four of Wands in reverse, guys. You know, I do know that it's still kind of a good card. Um, it's just not as stable as you would like it to be, but it's still okay. You know, there is still some happy times coming in. Yes, it's just you gotta work on the stability a little bit. You know, you gotta like take your time, I guess, to work towards perfect stability. It's still kind of, you know, it's still in the process. It's still getting better. Stability is almost there. Just got to take a few more steps towards it, which you are. You are in November. You know, you're working towards it. I'll pull a couple more cards. The shadow side, you know, the devil. Some kind of um, unhealthy environment that you're trying to move away from. I honestly think you will, guys. Yes, you will. Okay. I don't want to pull any more cards. I'm going to pull outcome cards, but that's it. You will have your new beginning. It might be practical, you know. I don't know who you're dealing with, but somebody's definitely not making you happy. Somebody ruthless. It could be you acting like that towards somebody. It could be all of these could be yours, you know. I mean, who knows. But it's also, you know, the person that's making you feel like crap. It's like you're trying to let them go, but somebody is pulling you back, even in November. And you know that there is no stability, and you know that you need to move on. And there is like an yes, yes, guys. Okay, good, good. You've got two aces here. You know, ace of wands is like a new passionate start, something fast to start, something you might not expect. Shut up. You might not expect it. You know, something like that but it's nice it's a really it's a really good ace okay and this is more of a practical beginning possibly getting a new friend or uh like a love interest or something like that and uh, actually you guys have got almost yeah you've got all aces here uh yeah two of them are in reverse for for now you know honestly what i think what i usually think when i get these aces in reverse i do believe that it's still new beginnings and they are coming there's just a delay on them right now so you will get your clarity, you will get your Ace of Cups, you know, you will get your emotional fulfillment. However, it's probably not going to happen in the beginning of November, you know, but you do get two Aces at the end, okay? Let me pull outcome cards. And if you're single, okay, you're dealing with a crazy ex or something, you're trying to move away successfully, okay, you are moving away, that's good. You're working towards stability. You know, there might be some kind of a delay on your on you, new start or you're worried about a new start or something. However, you're going to move away from that, you know, from devil to ace of pentacles. Like that's that's a good uh, step forward. What is the outcome for Libras for November 2017? King of Wands, okay. Could be dealing with a, uh, a fire sign. Six of Wands, victory, okay, that's good. You know, recognition, some kind of attention, feeling proud of something, that's good. Possibly feeling proud of, possibly feeling proud of being able to move away from this toxic environment, from this, you know, devil person, I don't know. And being successful at it, that's good. The Hermit in reverse. Knight of Swords in reverse. That's good, guys. The Hermit in reverse getting out of that lonely feeling, you know, that you don't want to be around anybody. You just want to go within and be in the Hermit mode. You know, nobody even knows if you're alive or not. You're coming out of that. That's good. That's good. You know, you're going to be socializing more, being out more. That's good. And uh, Knight of Swords in reverse, just not rushing into anything new, possibly. Yes, you. this is why you got an Ace of Pentacles here, too. You know, it's like um, moving towards something slowly. 
you know, moving away slowly, working on yourself slowly, moving towards a new start slowly, you know, not taking any risks, not going into it, to, with the, you know, like a crazy person, not rushing into it, that's good. And that Ace of Wands that I saw on the bottom of the deck, that's probably just all about, you know, it is going to be a new start for you. Yes, definitely. And it's probably going to be something passionate, you know, it's either connected with your work or connected with your social life, but something is definitely going to distract you. You know, that new start, I don't think it's like a new passionate start with like a, a person. That's not what I think it is. I think this one is taking it slow towards a new beginning, being successful at it. It's a once, I think it's more like uh, getting distracted by something else and working towards your happiness, you know, doing something you're passionate about and uh, getting rid of those negative thoughts about this person. Whoever this is, guys, but they, it looks like they kind of messed you up. I don't know. All right, guys. Well, I hope you enjoyed my reading and um, I'll see you next month. Bye-bye.